The United States Conference of Catholic Bishops welcomed the McCarrick Report presented by the Holy See. When the former nuncio in the United States, Carlo Vigano, accused the Pope of covering up McCarrick's crimes, 24 bishops joined him in varying degrees to call for clarification and facts. The conference's president, Archbishop Jose Gomez, says the bishops are studying the published findings. He also expresses support for the Pope for his pastoral concern and his leadership in calling the Church to greater accountability and transparency. He says the facts presented in the McCarrick Report are another tragic chapter in the Church's long struggle to confront the crimes of sexual abuse by clergy. That's why Jose Gomez expresses his closeness to the victims of the former Archbishop of Washington and to all survivors of sexual abuse by the clergy. He also expresses his profound sorrow and deepest apologies as he and all the U.S. bishops renew their commitment to ending abuse within the church. The damage done to victims of abuse in the church is irreparable. However, spreading their stories will help prevent abuse from being repeated. We've been dead for a long time, long decades, and we need someone to say, come out and untie us. It is also necessary to know which good practices have helped people return to the church. Like Susan, a victim of abuse at the age of 15. 